properties of metals. In this video, you're going to identify some, but not all, the properties of metals. You'll be taking notes in your workbook. Click pause whenever you need to to write your notes. The first property is luster. So identify, based on metals, do they tend to be shiny or dull? Please write it down in your notes. Based on these three images, which property do you think metal has, being malleable or brittle? So malleable means able to be hammered or pressed out of shape without breaking, and brittle means to break easily. So based on these images, which property do you think metal has, malleable or brittle? Write it down in your notes. Are metals ductile or not? So ductile means... Um, made into wire or is easily shaped or molded. So based on these three images, do you think metals are ductile or not? Write it in your notes. So are metals good conductors or insulators? So conductors are able to transfer heat or electricity easily. Or insulators, they poorly conduct heat or electricity. So write down your notes. What do you think metals are, conductors or insulators? Metals can be two things. They can either be a pure metal element or they can be an alloy, meaning it's a mixture of a metal element and another metal element or a mixture of a metal element and another element. So let's look at this. So some pure metal elements would be copper, tin, iron, zinc. Some alloys would be putting together copper and tin and making bronze. Another alloy would be mixing together iron and carbon and making steel. A third example of an alloy would be taking copper and zinc, mixing them together, and it makes brass. So elements can be pure metal elements, but they also can be alloys. So write that in your notes. Do metals tend to be more dense or less dense? So think about when we've done the density labs. Did they sink or did they float? Write down what you think metals are, more or less dense in your notes. What state of matter do metals tend to be at room temperature? Solids, liquids, or gases? Write down your answer in your notes.